Bonjour, it's Craig from Contact. I'm coming to you from site in Topo. Construction is just over 90% complete and we're on track to be operational by the end of the year. We've seen a lot of progress on site since our last video, so let's take a look. First up, the cooling tower. This massive structure cools the water, which is used to condense the steam that exits the turbine. It also cools the generator and oil used throughout the plant. It's a big building and measures more than 230 meters long. It has 13 fans which each have 7 meter long blades. These fans draw air across the water that has been cooled as it flows down through the tower. It processes the equivalent of 14 Olympic sized swimming pools every hour and is the largest capacity of all the geothermal power stations in New Zealand. Over to the steam field. These pipes supply and return the hot geothermal fluid we use for producing steam. They are lagged and clad in green aluminium covers to retain heat in the geothermal fluid and for personnel safety. The fluid from the reservoir comes in at around 210 degrees Celsius and the fluid we return to the reservoir is at 110 degrees, so the pipes are way too hot to touch without insulation. The project reached a major milestone in March this year with the installation of the two turbines that drive the single 189 MVA generator. The turbines spin at 3000 RPM and each weighs around 62 tons, has 17 stages or rows of blades which are driven by a total of 500 tons of steam every hour. They were designed by Fuji Electric and are rated to deliver 174 megawatts of power to the transmission grid. That's enough power to supply the entire needs of Tauranga or 3.5% of the whole country. Like many areas in New Zealand, our site was affected by Cyclone Gabriel in February this year. We had a bit of damage to construction temporary works like smoko shelters and crates got shredded by the wind. But this was quickly fixed thanks to our awesome team on site and we weren't delayed by the clean up too much. It's really pleasing and humbling to see how the hard mahi and long hours that the construction crew put into this project have transformed the paddock that was here three years ago. We're proud to be part of something tangible that is decarbonizing New Zealand by generating clean and renewable electricity. We'll see you again next time with more updates on our progress of Tohara. Namihi Nui.